Copeland slotted behind his left tackle. Mettenberger back to pass for the first time. Goes into the flat to Jeremy Hill. Wow. Two wide receivers. Now the tight end comes way wide to the left. Mettenberger got a man. It's Jarvis Lane. LSU has trailed in the season 2013. Play action. Mettenberger rolling right, being chased by Jenkins, and that one intended for... Did he get his arm on Beckham? Well, it oh, was... Oh, I think the, so. I think, I mean, uh, interesting, at the LSU bench, very surprised not to get that call. And let's Look at last. Last. This LSU team has played so well on the road, as you saw with that graphic. Here comes the blitz. Mettenberger across the middle. Got a man! It's Cadron Boone of all people, and he strolls in on touch. Right here with the safety coming up way too early. He knew it from the get-go. Bad technique by Swan taking an outside technique and real, real slim, simple. There are these guys are too good. Even with Mugger coming in there unblocked. He knew he his mom Tammy has worked in the Georgia Athletic Department for 14 years. Here's Mettenberger, rolls out, finds Jeremy Hill. He's tough to bring down. As the athletic director, uh, as the offensive coordinator, beg your pardon, four less miles. Mettenberger, beautiful route. Jarvis Landry broke one tackle. And up wide. That forces a linebacker to go out with him. Monique Wilson has Trent out there with Dixon. Mettenberger, no pressure. Touchdown, Cadron Boone's second of the backer out. Now he's got these two defenders inside on Landry. If both of them go with Landry, he'll throw to the next one. They both go, throw to the next one. Beautiful job, beautiful read. It was Shaq Wiggins, a freshman safety. Shaq's use of the silent snap count Declaring the blitz. Watch when he lifts his leg, that declares the blitz. He reads it. He knows it's coming in his mind now. He knows he's got the bottom of the screen one-on-one. -on -one. Even with an unblocked player, he knows exactly where that ball. Now, down the goal line, read your keys. Take the linebacker out with a tight end. Two guys inside, three on two. Who takes one guy, two on one? Somebody's got to be the other guy. That is good coaching. Fourth offensive possession. 14 all. Play action. Mettenberger looks to his right. Has a lot of time. And one up. Connor Neighbors is in it. Fullback. That's Neighbors coming bottom of the screen. Mettenberger across the middle. Great. Jeremy Hill. Wow. She's. I mean, Cameron is grabbing plays from the Baltimore Ravens. Shift the fullback out against the deep zone. See the two deep safeties. Drop it off to the running back. And Ray Rice, I mean, Jeremy Hill <laughs> takes that ball and goes for it. Well, Trey Matthews. I mean, it's a perfect storm. And then top that off, the two defenses last year, they had 15 players combined drafted in the NFL. Exactly. Third down. Blitz up the middle. Same play. Yeah. And this one because of the blitz. Yeah, it was Leonard Floyd that put the pressure on and forced that ball out before he 11 underclassmen entered the draft. Eight of them were drafted. An NFL record. Second down, seven. Mettenberger. Oh. Eight. Was it Leonard Floyd again, number 84? It was. Wow. He's having a good football game. He is a freshman, one of four starting... Swan up to play bump and run. Corners lay back on the other side. Mettenberger hit and dropped from behind. Ray Drew, number the defensive end. He's learning the defense. He's big, he's strong. Jordan Jen Jennings said he's coming on fast and he's in South Carolina. Today, they are standing tough. Connor Neighbors is the fullback. Mettenberger drops straight back as time. And a wide open receiver, Odell Beckham. Look at that room to step into the throw. Beckham just schooled Swain on the play. 
Beckham's a, basically an NFL receiver yes. playing college ball. Yes. But not being able to run the ball by LSU. There's a defensive switch by Georgia before the snap. Now Georgia very confused here. They're going to have trouble with this bunch. Swain has no idea what to do. Out of the flat is Dixon. That one is caught, but it'll be short of the first down. Third and four. Five wide. Stunts defensively. Mettenberger across the middle. Caught first down. Oh, basically turned his career around. That time he threw in traffic. He was getting rushed inside by Ray Drew. The four yard line. Alfred Blue makes his first appearance in the ball game. They fake the ball to him. Mettenberger caught and dropped. Second sack for the first half. Not too much at all. Jordan Jefferson and Lee were the quarterbacks, but last year came into his own. That's incomplete. Ball a bit high, ball a bit quick. It'll be about a 48-yard field goal from here. We haven't had one play like that in this football game. Well, they do line up in the eye to start the second half. And Copeland is the fullback. Mettenberger goes deep left side. Nice defensive. Timed it out right, and that was, that time, a perfect play to the outside, and that's how you play defense. And again, the eye formation with Hill, the deep back behind J.C. Copeland. That's Landry, who starts in motion. Play action. Good blocking up front. And the crossing pattern from Landry spins and is... Alfred Blue is split wide right. I just don't think that George is lined up right again. This deep and overthrown. Watch Swain over here. He's going, where's the guy back here? He's pointing, pointing. On the other side of the field, you see Langley say, what's going on? Definitely a busted coverage, and they got away from it. Got away with it. Landry on a crossing route. He's wide open. He's still over. Yep. Yeah. Quick hitch out to the right. Good block. What a block. That freedom. We were talking to the coaches. There's one thing when Cam, I said, Cam, how do you distribute the ball to your different playmakers? He's a effort. First and ten. Just inside the 40. Hilliard remains the running back. Mettenberger going deep down the middle. It's incomplete. All oh, his teammates trigger Trey. Yeah, it was a great throw, great defense. You know, he didn't get a, a free shot on him. It wasn't the defenseless player. I think he went through the ball. Good play by everybody. Georgia mixed up defensively now. Have to scurry to get everybody set. Oh, man, oh, Herrera is looking back. There's a little screen underneath the hill. And there was some confusion. Nobody's covering the guy up to the top of the screen. That's amazing. Mettenberger goes down the middle. Perfect. Landry slips the tackle. Touchdown. He's back here. This is Josh Harvey Clemens right here, right in between them. But there was such a mix-up to the other side of the field. And I don't know if Georgia knew exactly what they were doing on the play. Well, let's take a look from behind Zach Mettenberger. He can throw the ball, can he? A 35-yard dart right down the middle to Landry. We wondered, would LSU figure out a way to get Beckham and Landry in the game? They did less than can, wouldn't he? Wouldn't he? Mettenberger right side. Beckham. Swan brings him down from behind. It has really helped uh, Georgia the stack twin formation where both Landry and Beckham are, and it cost him seven points. And here is LSU running the ball. Yeah, there's one of those. To hit turn. No, I, I mean, it, the, you, you might as well count those as runs. Very close to a measure that has given Georgia a little trouble. Beckham and Landry. That's Dixon, the tight end. McGee is the running back now. Play action. Mettenberger, again, no pass rush. And again, a man wide open. Did he control the ball? I don't think so. Ball was put in the right spot. Harvey Clemens comes right into the midsection. Doesn't cheap shot. 
LSU has won seven and lost six in Sanford Stadium. One of the few teams. He's coming. Oh, he's Drops back. Mettenberger. He thought he was too. Cool. Oh, wow. He tweets Jarvis Jones. And Jarvis Jones would have made that. <laughs> Both receivers near side. Three-man rush. Mettenberger deep in the middle. Caught. What a play. Wow, Jarvis Landry. Ball again put in a perfect position. You can't throw it any better. Cam Cameron calls it throwing the receiver open. That's exactly. Actually, Todd Grantham that time had a trick defense on. Zach thought it was too deep, but it's a shift this way. He throws the ball into between three Georgia defenders. Watch the shift to the middle of the field. He has the defense on that he wants, but he throws a perfect. Georgia was on offense inside the 20, and now they start raising the roof. It's Hilliard, that running back. Jeremy Hill hasn't seen action in the last series or two. Here's Mettenberger back. Uh -oh. I heard a whistle. I, I think this was a messed up. Yeah, nobody blocked him that time. There was a lot of calls and check with me's and switching out of plays before the snap. And you No, now they bobbled the Bobble snap. snap. Loose ball. I think LSU with each other. Jarvis Jones is getting on him about no sack. Now look at this. Kenny Hill. Three down linemen. Mettenberger drills it right side. Caught by Beckham. That needed 23, got 24. I mean, not only that, the defense was lined up right at 23. And Beckham. Top of the screen. I formation. Play action. Mettenberger across the middle. Crossing pattern again. It's short crossing route. We call them orb over routes. In a position to maybe run this thing out and put points on the board. Mettenberger. Again the crossing route. Again it's Landry. And again in this tackle. Same play as Byrne told you. Two receivers, top of the screen. Play action again. Mettenberger got a man open. It's Beckham. And he's down to the seventh green. His dream had him in a Georgia helmet and colors. But he's now doing it for LSU. A hostile environment. Georgia brings four. Got oh, it. man. Floyd and Jenkins. When Jordan Jenkins said, you know what, they're count Leonard Floyd as a freshman, I count him as part of my class. Across the middle deep, caught by Beckham. Go across the middle. I don't care if there's three guys there. I'll hit you with the football. Here's the snap on first down. Across the middle incomplete. Is there a play? That was intended for Jarvis Landry. I must say, we own top of the screen. That's Dixon, the tight end. Back to supply blocking help. Mettenberger. That one took off on it. It, it might have been ten. Sure. I think it was great. Yes, Third and ten. Blitz up the middle. Mettenberger across the middle. Incomplete is there. A it's number 25. Harvey Clemens did. And you know, you've got to adapt. When you're the defensive backs and they're not calling it, you can be physical. It take a lot though. Fourth and ten. That's Dixon. Oh my gosh, Mettenberger heaves it, it's incomplete, it'll go over on down. 